Hello. Nice here. Set beasts. Last time we definitely did things. We have a dog now. Dog friend. Barkley. <laughs> um, what else happened? We got an ability. Can boost higher while flying just by holding the button. And can reboost by pressing it again. Um, I don't really remember what else. It must not have uncovered many map tiles. Anyway, um, I think I was trying to capture stuff around here for the sake of building up some EXP. Oh yeah, because I need the blue power here. Yes, makes sense. <laughs> I guess maybe I should check my rumors to see if there's anything else I could be doing. Actually, I think we have a rumor of a captain. We could captain fight. Um... Yeah, Captain Lodestein. And we have some land keepers to fight. Maybe I'll grab Eugene for that. Or maybe I won't. Oh, hey, it's a Jellyton. They do, in fact, have a field sprite. They normally make up most of the enemies in one particular area. Activated the lift. Alright. Hey, copy of Desperation. Is that a one way? There is like a cave behind that waterfall. Because of course there is. I don't know why they bothered making the rock blow air, considering... You can, uh, resist the air just by dashing, which is the same thing that breaks rocks. <laughs> Maybe it's a tutorial on how to resist air. Oh, I've been up here. Anyway, this power is really useful. <laughs> hmm. Blue with you in a second, bud. I've just got some final repairs to make. I'm just realizing this music while conversing with the captain is another version of the actual battle music. Da -da -da -da. Ba -da -da. Da -ba -da -da -da. Levi Lodestein. Anyway, he's all done. He works with the rangers to keep the lights on. You want to know a secret? We harness electricity for the town's power grid with these pylons, but we have, er, but we really have no idea how they well. work. My educated guess is that there's a unique kind of background electricity here on New World that these pylons can conduct and store. Oh yeah, that's also the justification for why air types are weak to lightning. But these wouldn't work on Earth at all. Not a chance. Earth's atmosphere doesn't work that way. Hmm? Enough science talk. You're here to take my ranger captain challenge, am I correct? Yeah. Great. Great, this won't shock you to hear, but my area of expertise in battle is electricity. You'll have to be quick on your feet if you don't want to be struck by lightning. Are you really just elemental? Best of luck. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Turns out I don't actually know this song. Yeah, that's the part. Um. <laughs> the title's face down. You can hear it with lyrics if you look it up. Oh, nice. Tripwire. We lowered both their accuracies. Um, I guess I jump scare?
I didn't exactly save enough AP to use a uh, icebreaker. <laughs> I don't know this song very well. I haven't fused against many captains. <laughs> and it's not my favorite. Like, I really like like chimeras, which is what plays against the fused monster. And let's see. I also like same old story, which is the archangel song. I hope the d smack doesn't go off, cause okay, nice. Uh, it would have given them uh, conductive. I should probably actually just be swapping. Um, sure. <laughs> uh, anyway, I don't have a whole lot to say about this fight. We're just clearly winning. And... Yeah. Turns out having an element instead of a plan may not uh, be super effective. And we're performing better than he thought we would. Oh, hey, it's the evolved form of the thing I need to capture in order to get the electromagnetism skill. Spoilers, the blue things are related to electromagnetism, as you might have observed from the thing he was setting up. Oh, plastic knife him. That'll be effective. Double accuracy downed. <laughs> okay, now just the regular accuracy down from unit target. I guess I did happen to have in my starting lineup a type that was effective on electricity, and the metal type just didn't hit it. Actually, would it have been bad? I, I'm not confident in that part of the type chart. Uh, glass is kind of weird for me still. He uses melee defense instead of melee attack. Is that good? Yes. Okay. <laughs> uh, maybe get rid of focus? Bobber, hit one target multiple times. 120 effective power for five. I mean, it's reasonably costed. I think I won't put it on though. Just don't have the slots. <laughs> that was a pretty electrifying fight, if I'd say so myself. Achievement unlocked, electrifying. The achievements agree. Forgive me for the puns, it's a force of habit. Go on, here's your reward. Number six. Got a charge sticker. Really love to chat a bit longer, but unfortunately I have some maintenance work left to do here. Good luck out there, bud. Uh, if you had maintenance work left to do here, why'd you leave? Yeah, these blue things. They're electromagnetic. I'm gonna look around Harbor Town for rumors, because I don't want to go to the next area yet. I did have some engineering work to do back at the shop, but I might just swerve it for now. Yeah! Yeah, you gotta take a break sometimes, buddy. Wait, what did you say just now? Uh... Uh, I said I had some engineering work to do? What did you say after that? I was gonna swerve it? Huh? Is that a phrase? To swerve something? Oh. Oh, I mean, yeah. Like, if you're gonna skip out on doing something or going somewhere, that's you swerving it. <laughs> Okay, gotcha. I shall embrace your unusual slang with an open mind. I think I'm gonna swerve this whole conversation. Uh, let's see. Yeah, resting wouldn't hurt. Might as well pick up Eugene while we're here. Bar Barkley's been a really good boy today, so you make sure he gets all the treats and belly rubs. Be nice to get that spring heel evolved, but 
Barkley doesn't have any more personal quests to do. Momentous! Momentous? I guess I should have looked for rumors before resting. Because resting would clear all the rumors. Oh well. Ranger Outpost conversation. I simply find it difficult to sympathize with the plight of the human race. That's understandable. People could be confusing, unpredictable. Nah, I disagree. Humans are not unpredictable. You can predict their behavior very easily, in fact. Human beings will make the stupidest decision possible in any given scenario as long as there's even a minuscule short-term reward. <laughs> I appreciate your honest analysis, Cleo. Humans don't ge or generally don't make decisions based on the odds. They make them based on their emotions. So do I. It is my emotions that tell me that mankind is inherently stupid and will eventually sow the seeds of its own destruction. Well... Well, until that happens, your services in the Rangers will still be valued. <laughs> Alright, insightful. Um... Alright, well, let's fight landowners. Uh, or land keepers. Not sure which of these is going to be lower level. Because we might actually need the swim ability to get to this one or something. <laughs> I know you don't need flight to get to this. You don't need flight to get to anything. Like, possibly swimming and the ball? Oh wait, no, you need electromagnetism. Okay. If you miss a payment on your home, we'll freeze your assets. Are you gonna use ice types? Wow. Consider my assets in danger of being frozen. Wasn't gonna matter which I picked. Oh, they're only level 25, huh? Oh no, my speed. I don't think they had another tape anyway, but got them. Bloodlust. Automatically raises users' melee and ranged attack when an opponent is defeated with plus one duration. Probably better than Vengeful Curse. I think I'm more likely to defeat enemies than they are to defeat me. Malchemy learning Toxic Stab. I'll take it over Bonbon bon Blast. Even though the melee attack is lower, I didn't actually have a way to poison an enemy that's not weak to poison. Ouch, now my assets are Thaw. I guess specifically weak to poison in a way that poisons. Um, because they could also be weak to poison in a way that berserks. If they're astral. If you don't vacate immediately, we'll be forced to evict you ourselves. Oh yeah, Shot in the Dark is also really good. Unfortunately, fusion's not unlocked. Ah, uh, wait, I don't want an earth type hitting my glass type. We'll go double astral. <laughs> um. Uh. Great use of your time there, dudes. Didn't. <laughs> Provoke a reaction because we just one shot them. Uh huh. Oh. Well, that's inconvenient. Um. 
could Sonic Boom, but it wouldn't lower their AP gains. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I wanted to use an 100% accuracy move on Kingrave in case the battering ram missed again. Oh no, Vengeful Curse. Oh, sleep is actually kind of funny considering which monster this is. Still, normally when you're asleep, you want to get a benefit out of the fact that you're sleeping. Also, I don't have it alongside uh, the thing that raises accuracy. Well, Enjoy your gambit turns without having normal AP gain and normal accuracy. <laughs> also, I'm gonna put up a wall. I don't think I can actually deal damage fast enough to really kill them. Try to inflict... Actually, more turns of accuracy down doesn't do anything. Try to get a little HP back. I could also save for next turn and use Nurse, but whatever. Actually, next turn the enemy's gonna go first, lose their Gambit, and then die before I could possibly use Nurse. And just pick something. We're gonna need to go back to rest, but we also have a guaranteed win here. Gambit failed. <laughs> Kinda wish that didn't trigger if the fight was won. Just an extra animation. Multi-target status. Might be better than multi-strike, because for multi-strike you have to pay the extra AP for the second use of your move. Um, but at the same time, I don't have a lot of single target moves here. It would just be I could spam Zephyr instead of Sonic Boom. <laughs> well, and I could do AoE. Yeah, we won't bother with broadcast. Alright! Another office liberated from those creeps. Nice work, Klyseer. Thanks. Grab our fused material, walk out of the building so I can fast travel. Rest because we had a monster go down. Oh. Uh. Really don't get it. What is the internet? Half the people in Harbor Town are crying over how much they miss it. Uh. You know, the internet? Like, on computers or phones? On phones? Do you speak to people over it? What was the current year in your world before you came here, Meredith? 1989, why do you ask? Oh. Oh, okay. I can see we're maybe a little out of sync with each other. He's as old as me. Alright, the chat about workout routines. Broken tapes repaired. I mean, I was gonna fast travel again anyway to get closer to the landowners, so might as well fast travel here in the middle. Landkeepers. I keep using the wrong name for them. Mm. Another train station, huh? This island sure holds some secrets. Yeah, it does. Um... Where I'm from, there's empty buildings like this across the whole country. Because of the landkeepers doing something? I guess. Oh, well. I didn't do this fight. Want to know where your cassette tapes come from? You'll have to deal with me first. Okay, you're just level 27. I thought they were going to be higher level because they're in the mall. Maybe I just have the mall's level wrong? Or maybe randomizer affects more than I realized? Might be offering me a lower level mall because I got Vine Ball. I didn't think the randomizer even had logic for where the powers happened to end up, though, and that's why you can buy them back in the base. 
So it would be weird if it was adjusting levels to account for where the powers were. Hmm. Mall up ahead is where the tapes and cassette players come from. It just popped into existence a few years back. Rangers have been raiding it for supplies since then, so you won't find many left in there. I've heard it's haunted, though. What do you think? I think it's pretty haunted. I saw some spirits bouncing around. Yes. Everything starts with capital. Every sentence, every name, every investment. Bye now. Uh-huh. Oh, a hop skin. That's the evolution path I'm thinking of taking Barkley down. Just smack and shoot. Oh. Well, the flinch is inconvenient, but we got the sticky spray. So, get stabbed. I think he was down before the lyrics would have kicked in. <clears throat> At least the health had depleted. I don't know if uh, he'd actually gone through the loss animation. <laughs> Not since Nixon took, took us off the ghoul standard have we seen such a rush to purchase property. Is that so? Norman Gold? Oh. Yeah, I was talking about that reaction earlier. Weak to poison, but doesn't get poisoned by it. Oh well. So they get a little extra AP. I was gonna attack anyway. Nice crit. Eugene with that monster, the Galagor is such a tank. I don't think Galagor was meant to have 10% boosted stats. <laughs> oh, I didn't even read that. Uh, well, you can go back and pause if you cared. Hmm. Landkeepers here are here to help New World grow into a developed nation. The first step is establishing a currency. The most popular op option among landkeepers right now is to peg it to the value of the soul, an extremely scarce resource where we're from. If you'd like, you can deposit your soul with us for legal tender. Rather not. Scampire. I'm gonna smack it and shoot it. Oh. It got the energy shot off first. <sighs> I'm gonna take a little glass shards damage, but it's fine. I thought about, like, just switching, but, uh, Eugene went after them, so I would take some damage either way. Ritual. Brings the user back to life at 25% HP upon defeat. I won't equip that. I'd rather use Nurse, unless... Well, if the enemy's dealing so much damage, I actually care about Ritual over Nurse. I'm probably losing the fight anyway. <laughs> New World's favor and barter economy is quaint, but it's not going to last. After all, what's the point of it all if the upper class can't print quadrillions of favors out of nothing? Yeah. Oh, yeah, meant to have electromagnetism here, huh? As prospective tenants, it is in your best interest to remain on good terms with the Landkeepers Association. You wouldn't want to be cast out of your homes, would you? Hey! If you think you're taking anything from us, you might want to reevaluate. Do you only get dialogue there if you brought Eugene? Or rather, get the second half of it if you brought him? Or would anyone have said something there? Thinking of um, alternating spit, sonic boom, sonic boom rather than just energy shot or Zephyr all the time. Or I guess it's rotating, not alternating, if it's a three-move sequence. Oh, well, jump scare would also save the AP. Oh, it didn't flinch, actually. Pow. So you don't have a way to become AoE, just... Wait. I, I saw Stab and was like, oh yeah, I'm selecting Toxic Stab. Actually, let's sticky spray you. 
I've been thinking of swapping sticky spray with stab in the dark so that I manually cast sticky spray and then we have a higher activation chance on tripwire because it'll be on a zero AP move and then we hopefully get lots of hits with it. Huh. I don't think I have the HP to actually tank the glass shards, so I'm not actually going to stab in the dark. Um, go for something else that deals melee damage, though. On account of I have a melee damage up and also I adjusted my stats at the gym to be more melee tilted. I guess I can use Battering Ram without missing, at least. I think I'm just going to swap instead of actually taking the death. Ah, glass shards is done. That's convenient, considering I'm using a melee attack. Just kidding, I'm not using a melee attack. Eugene continuing with the energy well never mind, not continuing with the energy waves. Nice crit. <laughs> the flinches were getting annoying. stuff all right they didn't stand a chance gym locked on your best behavior part four i think there are two or three offices left counting the end of the quest we're getting there i think next time well i have a couple minutes I'm gonna rest grab meredith and see what the level of the mall is Okay, we discussed potential battle strategies, as one does. Uh... Oh, we traveling again so soon? Huh? Another underground train station, huh? I wonder who built these. I wonder if we're about to die. Huh? Oh yeah, a team locked, Fall Down Mall. I brought Meredith to Fall Down Mall. If I'm being honest, I bet this place looked way tackier before all the structural decay. I admire the post-apocalypse cheek. Cheek? How's that pronounced? That shop up there looks like the kind of place you'd find music, right? Let's find a way to reach it. Alright, you. Oh, I should be engaging with Vine Balls so I get the plant shield. Oh, they're actually way lower level than us. I was simply mistaken. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we'll uh, raise the difficulty next time. Temporarily, while we do this area. And uh, yeah, shouldn't uh, put it off so long, I guess. And then we'll drop the difficulty again and do the west end of the world after this. I don't know what difficulty would be appropriate, but I'll raise it like two clicks, I guess. Graphics, audio, gameplay. Oh, maybe I'll raise it three clicks, so it's actually one word higher. Um, I feel like saving in the train station instead of out there for some reason. <laughs> but anyway, that'll be it for this part. So yeah, 